Hi, I'm Jenna Hip, Green Celebrity Nail Stylist, and today we are going to be talking about basic polish application. Let's get started. And now that we've properly prepared Jody's nails for polish, we are ready to paint. And I'm going to use a shade, one of my favorites, from my collection called I Can Afford It. I love this color because it has a perfect pearlescent amount um, in the purple, so it's not too shiny, it's not too glittery. And the main thing I want to talk about when applying nail polish, believe it or not, is not actually applying it to the nail, but how you remove the brush from the bottle, because it really does make a big difference. So when removing the brush from the nail polish bottle, you want to be sure to get rid of any excess polish that might drip down the wand. We're going to swirl the wand of the nail on the lid of the glass, and then sweep the brush away from you, like so. This way you're going to be getting the perfect amount of polish to go on as your first coat on your nails. And it started with one stripe down the middle, starting at the top of the cuticle. And now I'm doing a swipe on each side. You also want to make sure that you don't store your nail polish in the refrigerator. A lot of people tend to do that and it's an extreme that is too cold for nail polish because when it gets to room temperature you're going to find that clumpy formula. You also don't want to store it in any place that's near the sun or too hot. But we're going to do coat two but I wanted to show you a little trick in between coat one and coat two that's going to really help your nail polish stay a lot longer and chip free on the edges. So we just finished painting Jody's second coat of nail polish, and now we're gonna go through and perfect each nail by using my favorite eyeliner brush, believe it or not, and some just simple nail polish remover. So we're gonna dip our angle brush and go through each nail. And this is one of my very, very best tips that I use on all of my celeb clients behind the scenes. Whenever you look at a magazine or you see the cover of nails and you say, wow, those nails look amazing, it's probably because someone went through with a very detailed angle brush like this and went through and perfected each nail. Now we're on our final step, which is the high shine top coat. A very important step, you don't want to miss it. This is going to seal in all of the hard work that you've just done with your manicure. When applying the top coat, you want to make sure to fully cover the nail and seal in the polish underneath. I try to apply my top coat in four strokes or less. And there you have it, my hip tips for a perfect polish application.